everyone and welcome to another TDR Family Gaming video. This is Droid TDR and we are here in the camp in Minecraft Dungeons, still the beta version that we're playing with and I'm going to show you something crazy that I stumbled upon. It is, how did I get from over there to over here when the drawbridge is up? Well, a little bit of magic, a little bit of fancy footwork and I'll show you how it's done. All right, I got to give credit to a video I stumbled upon that showed this, and I was like, there's no way this actually is possible. So, this is how you do it. Watch very carefully, because you get very close to the edge. Just like normal Minecraft, you can walk along blocks that fences are on. You just can't jump over the fence. But there we are. We're right at the edge. You point to where you want to go. Maybe you put some speed on, maybe not. And then you accidentally flip the wrong way. That is not how you do it. So, let's go try this again. Wait, no, let's go try it again. And wait, no, let's try it again. Okay, so clearly, this isn't all that easy to do, but clearly I've also got it this time because I put the text right there. It said, clearly I've got this. So, here we go, come on, baby steps. Baby steps, one more. Got this, point to where you want to go and didn't make it. Erg. Good golly gosh, this is tricky. I don't know if I can do Well, let's see. I think I can do this. All right, positive attitude. Definitely can do it. Practice, practice, practice. Here we go. Third time's a charm. Little love. A little bit of anticipation right there. Oh, this is going to work. This is going to be it. Bam! Oh. Oof. Okay. I got no love that time. Let's go try it again. Because if there's something that Droid is good at doing, it's banging his head against the wall until something works, even if it's not supposed to. But, here we go. I'm sure this is going to be the time. Surely, we'll make it this time. And... Yes! What? Yes! We did it! Surely we would make it this time, and we did, and stop calling it Shirley. Okay, so we are on the other side. What the heck? We are on the other side of this drawbridge. What the heck is over here? What is coming after beta? Oh my gosh. Does the drawbridge really lower at some point? There's also... Wait, what? Is that a broken nether portal? It's got the right sounds. Got the sounds if you listen close. Let's see if I can go through it. Oh, I'm not in the nether. Thank goodness. That would have been crazy awesome in a beta. But, do you hear? Do you hear that, that glowing chiming sound that means that there's a chest somewhere nearby? Hard to hear because the nether portal keeps making sound, but... Listen real careful. Between the rustle of the trees, there's that little chimey, glowy sound. Let's see, maybe I can climb up here. Oh, I can climb up here. Well, huh? Uh, well, hmm. How do I? Oh, I get it. I have to jump. I have to jump. Totally have to jump. Let's make it up here. And boom! What? A black chest. Obsidian and diamond chest. Give me some of that. What is in there? Mm, not a whole lot, actually. Unfortunately. But hey, we found this crazy secret in the beta. I'm going to put the link down below on where I stumbled upon this, just so that other people can go and support that channel. But holy smokes. Okay, I got rare sickles, which are clearly not as good as the ones that I had before. So, what else do you do over here in this other half of the lobby that seems to basically be a dead end? Well, I wandered around it for about 20 minutes, trying to jump here, jump there, climb there, couldn't really get anywhere, jumped off of those stairs a whole lot of times. Anyways, that is the secret secret chest in the lobby. In the beta, who knows? I assume it'll be there in the real one too. So thank you all for watching and we'll see you in the next one. Bye.